Hey! Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Sword Bird Freakin' Lock. How are we all doing today? Let us do a quick team recap before we jump into the action. Because we've got a couple of things to do. First up, we have Cinder, our Galarian Moltres. Berserk ability, Gust, Ancient Power, Payback, Wing Attack. You may notice everyone's level has gone up by about one. That's because I sent them all on a job. Next up is Steven Seagal, the Pelipper, holding the Mystic Water. Uh, Drizzle ability, Stockpile, Swallow, Spit, and Water Paws. Looks like you changed up my freaking move set game. Thanks. I'm gonna have to go through and actually adjust their moves, it looks like. Frickin' A. Oh well. Uh, then there's Night Knight, the Corvus Squire, Keen Eye Ability, Scary Phase, Helm Claws, Power Trip, Pluck. Then there's Warlock, our Zatu, Synchronize Ability, Nightshade, Air Slash, Confuse Ray, Teleport. Then there's Pigeon, and Santa. Well, alright then. I guess I'm gonna have to go right here real fast. Uh, remember, move, please. Steven. Jesus Christ. Wow, you got rid of freaking Surf, my dude. Heckin' not awesome. Ugh. So we got two goals today. First goal is, uh... Well, I need to go get a Pokemon. You're like, what? A Pokemon? Air Slash? Heck yeah. Uh, we're gonna go get the Galarian Slowpoke Static Encounter! Let's heck and go! It's essentially a gift, so hush. Okay. I'm also gonna do Wing Attack. Uh, because we finally had someone who took the bait and decided to redeem! A trade. That's right, we're making a trade skis. We are trading in two gift Pokemon, two static Pokemon. And we're getting a shiny. Who's that shiny? Well, <laughs> just you wait and see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope, that's everything. Thank you. Oh, now that that's done. Take our way all the way over here to Wedgehurst. Mm-hmm. <laughs> This guy will show up here every time and constantly be told about it. So it's essentially a gift Pokemon. The train to the Isle of Armor has arrived. Those with the armor pass, please board the train. Do you have an armor pass? He, of course, I totally have one. Slow. Oh, slow. Oh, looks like another one's gotten on the train ridden over from the Isle of Armor. Hello. Yeah, I packed one train, right? If so, Pope Blast did get a cause trouble, so. You think you can catch it? Battle it in order to catch it. See, I got stuff. I was just like, where are they? I know I have you! Yep, 
You're gonna be called fodder. <laughs> Send to the box. All right. Well, thanks so much, Subhook, and cause big trouble. Wow, amazing. The way you caught Subhook was the absolute coolest. We apologize for the loop. We have to take your armor fast. Please head to the Isle of Armor. Okay. Head to a place called the Isle of Armor. I'm gonna catch some rare bug one, do some training. Let's hang out if we meet up there again, okay? Bye bye. Ugh. 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 If I roll my eyes any harder, I'm gonna hurt myself. All right, now it's time for us to do our quick and little the switch of Reno. So I'm gonna take a quick pause and when we come back, well, we're gonna have our, uh, our traded Pokemon, our shiny Pokemon. Well, I'm, I'm gonna have to do a lot of training for it, but anyway, yay, I will be right back. Alrighty, everybody. Here is our brand new Leak Warrior Far Fetched. Here's the old one. It's such a shame. And we're gonna. Oop. And we're switching you back out with Vision. Let's take a look at our Leak Warrior, shall we? I love how its colors make it look just like a regular one. <laughs> it, 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 if you need a reminder on what non-shiny looks like, it's darker. See, darker. Lighter. I guess. I don't freaking know, my dudes. Anyway, our real main goal, though, here is for us to go and tackle a certain gym. And that is exactly what we are doing right now. Slow moving, aren't you, Crow? I've already gotten earned my fire badge. That man of fire, Kabu, is just what you'd expect. You nearly got burned in my battle against enemy, but my strongest aim was definitely touch and go. Bro, you've got a Sobble. But I still want it. No, I have a Sobble. You have a score bunny. <laughs> but I still want it in the end. Get a shift on! I bet you could beat the man of fire, too. Yeah, I, I can. And I'm gonna. Ba -da, ba -da, ba -da -da. We don't have too many challengers since our leader Kabu has made his gym mission so hard. But I'll get you registered at once. Yep, yep. I just need five points, so that should be easy enough. <laughs> <laughs> that gem mission is this catching the most Pokemon to earn the most points. Five points. Mission start <laughs> I could just kill the Salandit, but Wow. You son of a witch. You double son of a witch! Both of you suck! Balls!
I have claimed Uno Poito! This really cool is potentially dangerous, but. If he uses a rock move on me, I'm going to be supremely up spaghetti. Oh good, he did. Oh. I've claimed another one point! Sizzling peeps. Two more battles, and we win. If you're wondering why I'm just using uh, Water Pulse, it's because I'm planning on using Surf for the Gym Lee Dare. What's Psycho Ship do again? Ah, uh, transfers the status condition. I don't need to. I have synchronized! Four points! And here's number five! Alright. And then after this, we go to our last and final challenge for the day. I fully expect to get hit with a Will of the Wisp by either the Ninetales or the Arcanine. So we'll see what ends up happening. Another mission cleared! Clearing leader Kabu's gym mission like that, you're positively on fire. Oh. Can I just go heal? Yes. <laughs> I'm curious if they'll actually just let me go back in there or not. Oh, all the challenges are gone. All the people. Oh, no, they're there. I was like, oh my god, no one wants to cheer for me anymore. Yeah, our new Leak Warrior will not have a chance to shine just yet. But he will shine eventually. He needs the levels again. I'll be honest, I prepared him in advance, but I had to make it appear like I didn't. <laughs> Simply because I knew, as soon as I saw that you guys wanted that switch, I went ahead and, and, and enacted it. Uh oh. Oh, I really have to redo it from the very, very, very beginning? Gosh darn it. Ugh! Oh. Okay, cool. So I can't just go straight there and straight there. Alrighty then. I forgot. Alright, time for our pre uh, fight spin. Pose. Go. Blah.
I like how he jogs and we're just walking our own pace. Welcome! I am Kabu, the fire type gym leader. The fact that you're here means you've bested both Milo's grass type Pokemon and Nisa's water types too. That's quite an accomplishment. Every trainer in Pokemon trains hard in pursuit of victory. That means your opponent is also working hard to win. In the end, the match is decided by which side is able to unleash their true potential. I mean, yeah. Duh. Faster than Nine Tails, definitely not gonna be faster than Arcanine. The only way I'd be faster than Arcanine would be probably by D-Max. Um which I'm thinking of doing. <laughs> Alright, Pelipper, it's time to go big, but not go home. Curious why I decided to Dynamax on Arcanine, but not on uh, Ninetales, is because just in case I can't one shot Senta Scorch. If you manage to flinch me, I'm gonna be pissed. Okay. Nice! I mean, we knew we were going to destroy him with a deluge of water. Leak War is already growing levels. Senti Scorch. I'm also gonna have to spend some time later, uh, making sure. Light that fire and get your mind moving, Cabo! Uh, we're gonna have to work hard on, uh, getting that triple, um, crits fight. Alright. It's time to see our first G Max. Though, theoretically, he should die right here. Let's go! Great Pokemon and a great trailer! It's no surprise that you won. Of course it's not. I'm often regarded as the first real roadblock of the gym challenge, and yet you defeated me. Clearly your talent surpasses my many years of experience. I mean, clearly. I still have much to learn. Yep. So I'm checking the next areas, uh, for, uh, burbs. Uh, I'm not seeing any currently. I know, yeah, but uh, fantastic team. Here, have this fire badge. Ooh, we could get a Fletchling, technically. Now we can catch Pokemon up to 35. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep that culture alive! Um... Uh, 
Looks like Fletchling might be the only Pokemon we can get. Yeah, yeah. He's telling us to do better. Be better. We can get Volibee, Fletchling... Or not Volibee. We can get Rufflet, Fletchling... Growl, I figured if anyone could do it, you and Pelipper would be the ones, but still, that match had me right at the edge of my seat. Okay. Congratulations, please take this TM. The Will of the Wisp. Also take one of our thingies. Think you've proven your skills, so head on down to Hammerlock! Thought the badger event ourselves, I reckon we should be alright even if we go up against the fierce Pokemon. Gym leader, but you still came all the way to see us off. Oh, I bet you can already tell I'm the one who'll be the next champion, yeah? There are many trainers who never manage to gather three badges and they just give up on the gym challenge altogether, so I make a point to see off any trainer who is able to defeat me. Oh, we made it! Thank goodness for flying taxis. Crow, hop, congratulations. It's pretty amazing you two defeated Kabu. A lot of gym challengers are able to get a gym badge from Kabu. We like to get together to show to see them off as a way of showing our support. So allow me to send you off with a proper sporty chair. Hustle, 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 hop! You can do it, you can do it, crap! The gym leaders you will face ahead are all tough opponents. But I believe that you will prevail. Believe in your Pokemon and push on forward. Thanks! We're gonna keep winning. And face you off in the championship cup. There's one new bird Pokemon I'm seeing so far. Hello again, wild area, my old friend. I've come back to you even stronger than before. Crap, Hammerlock is up uh, that way. Got it? <laughs> Granted, I'm only looking in the first section, which is Motostoke Riverbanks. Yeah, you can certainly rush straight there without a single detour. But now that you and I have a few gym badges, we should catch stronger Pokemon. So, I know what I'm doing. I'll be catching myself some amazing Pokemon to fill the next page of my tale of legend. Don't waste your efforts. It's not like either of you would ever make it through the gym challenge anyway. A champion really must have been off his rockin' to endorse the likes of you. And it seems Hop here can't even throw a Pokeball properly. Rubbish. More like you don't know enough to recognize greatness when you see it. My throws are the greatest, and my bro's the finest champion the world's ever seen. I'm not gonna listen to you insulting him. How tiresome. Fine, I'll battle you over there. Maybe that will help you finally understand just how weak you are. You're on then. I know you challenged Crow to battle in Galar Mine number two and lost her there. Now I'm her greatest rival. In other words, there's no way you're beating me. All this prattle about Crow and the champion and whatnot. Do you not have anything of your own to show? I'll show this Wally my real skills in battle! Yeah, uh, I wouldn't recommend it, my dude, but you do you. Uh, still looking, still looking. So, it's this area, right? That are the riverbanks? Mm -hmm. I believe it is. I guess I could just open the town map. No, that's North Lake Milo, South Lake Milo, Giant Sea. Oh, that's the riverbank. Mm. Oh, whatever. Um, up there, anything? No. There's like one Pokemon I'm interested in. At the Motosoka Riverbanks. 
Bridgefield. Um, we could get Rufflet. That's something. So far, it's Sigliff and Rufflet that we can get. That would be Burbs. Uh, Stony Wilderness. Ooh, Toka Tick, y'all! We could get ourselves eggshells. Of course, it's a random encounter, though. I'm better off just trying to get it in a raid. Let's see, Giant's Cap. There's not a whole lot, so. Alright. I just want to get a good idea of what's coming forward for me. You know, kind of cool my expectations. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Not a whole lot, really. It's kind of the story here. Ah, the Pokemon on the other side are strong. Okay. Thanks, my dude. I would have never guessed. Immediate Snorlax. Immediate Drapion! Uh. We can't do the fossil Pokemon, because neither of them are birds. It's a fish. And whatever the other thing is. <laughs> okay. Well, wow, nice. A lot of Rhyhorns. There's a Siglet. This one's wandering on its own, so are you safe? Nope. 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 Siglyph shouldn't have anything too harmful to me. Shouldn't. That's what I was worried about. Oh! Well, that's what, uh, this is for. A lot of dark types, yo. Whalmer, Basculin, Corviknight. Some real dangerous looking customers here, y'all. Bum, 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 bum. 
Next will be a really easy gym for us, but that'll take us a hot minute or three to get there, so. Um, I want to go somewhere where I can uh, leave off our Pokemon. Real fast. Or uh, have a quick teleport, which means I got to get around this trash. Bridge field. Oh, I bet. God, Lanoon. Oh, God, Lanoon. That is the proper response to that. Uh, we might have to spend a solid, like, episode or two going through, um... Um... Pokemon. Yeah, just Pokemon. Uh through Pokemon, uh, the Isle of Armor. Simply because it's gonna take a little bit to get to what I want. Oh, is this not a teleport spot? Well, that's lame. Do I have to talk to you, maybe? I'm planning on sending our Pokemon out on a job, so that's the reason <laughs> I'm doing this, so. Anyway, this is where we are going to leave it off for today, and when we come back, we'll do something. I'm not looking to run through Isle of Armor just yet. Let's do the Lotto ID, so. Anyway, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and until the next time, everybody... Stay funky people.